All right, guys, uh, we are here with an exclusive interview with two rather intimidating fellows uh, at the Lone Star Championship Wrestling uh, Busted for Autism event with the Clutch State Productions. I got Keith Lee and Shane Taylor. Hey, how y'all doing? Good, man. How are you? Probably better Too good. You. Well, you know, I'm, I'm a little... A little nervous right now. Oh, okay. Thank you. Don't be nervous. Yes. No, no. My boy's helping you out. Oh, he's helping me. All right, see you. <coughs> nice. That was a little high. But okay. All right. Questions. Questions. Oh, yes. Um. So, how'd you guys decide that you guys wanted to tag together? You want to take that or you want me to take that? You want rock paper scissors for? No. No. <laughs> oh, you can take it. Then. All right. Then. Right. I'm feeling good. All right. Here's the thing. Now you got a lot of tag teams down here in Texas, down yeah. in the south, all over, you know, all over the country that like to claim they're the best. They like to claim they're the biggest, they like to claim they're the baddest. Yeah. All of that. The problem is they're all lying to themselves. Mm -hmm. Because when you see somebody like Keith Lee, and you see somebody like Shane Taylor, mm -hmm. individually, we're two of the baddest dudes that this business has ever seen. Right. And now together. There's no team on the planet. I don't care who you bring in. I don't care who is watching this right now. Whether it's Red Dragon, whether it's War Machine, whether it's Hoyt and Harry over there and Noah, whether it's anybody that you want to say. You step in the ring with Keith Lee and Shane Taylor, we're going to beat your ass. You know, it, it only made sense to me. Yeah. I called Keith Lee up and I was like, look, man, we can keep you know, doing what we're doing and being successful, making a lot of money, mm -hmm. or we could come together and put the entire world on notice. That's what we're gonna do. All right, that sounds about right. Keith, you got something to say about that? I would like to add minor things. Yeah. First, this is the explanation of what we are. People ask us, what's your name? What does PBK stand for? So let me clear that up. It stands for Pretty Boy Killers. <laughs> now, when people will come to me and, well, Keith, what exactly does that mean? Why are you okay. called Pretty Boy Killers? No knee knocks. Easy up. I want to explain that fully. Now, we have many guys who run around here, and you see in the back, and they're getting stretched up, they're getting warmed up, and then they're turning around and putting on this baby oil and crap wetting their hair and all this other rubbish. We don't care about that. You can be prepared to be showmen. What we do is our show. The way we fight is our show. How hard Shane Taylor hits is our show. If I decide to jump and crush your life and or throw you 12 feet in the air, however high I decide that night, that's our show. We're not about pretty. We're not about oil. We're not about combing your hair and luscious locks or anything of that sort. We are PBK for a reason, and that is a statement we're going to make, not just nationwide, globally. Proceed. Okay, I just, uh, for the record, I don't consider myself a pretty boy. Just a regular Joe, so, you know. You sure? Because you got yeah. this situation up at the front that just says, like, I'm trying to be pretty. Well, you know, it's a little bit. I, I did. My so mom did it. My mom did it. Yeah, it wasn't. Yeah. Your, your mother did? Yeah. Your, your mom did your part. She said it looked nice. Yeah. His mother did it. You, you realize we're filming this. Yeah. You yeah. just said that. Well, you know, I, I love my mother. Please don't hurt me. Ask me another question before I question your face. Okay, uh, all right, another question, another question. Um, I know that you uh, have had a long history with Ray Rowe, and uh, <laughs> is, is, that, is that over, or are you teaming up with Keith just so you can specifically take on War Machine? I like this guy. You know, I, I, I have a question for you. Before okay. I answer that, Okay. where are you from? Well, I'm from Houston, from here. You're from Houston? Yes. Okay. Now, I'm from East Cleveland, you know that. Right, correct. Okay. Yes. So, in Houston, I'm assuming you've never gotten punched in the face for talking too much. Uh, well, but there was this one time no, in up. elementary. Shut up. But, oh, Shut up. Okay. That, that's what I'm talking about. See, I don't need help to take care of Ray Rowe. I have been whooping Ray Rowe's ass for damn near a decade. I... I'm the man that Ray Rowe can't seem to pin. 
can't seem to beat since I got to Texas. You see, all over the world, all over the country, Raymond Rowe is hard to kill. Raymond Rowe is death personified until he gets in the ring with me. Now you bring up War Machine. Fantastic team. One of the baddest teams in the world. If I wanted to, I could take Ray Rowe out and fight Hanson by my damn self. But there's no need. Because you see, while I'm going to take care of Ray Rowe, if we were ever to cross paths with War Machine, <laughs> Hanson, you would be staring directly into the face of one of the baddest men walking the face of the earth in Keith Lee. A guy like you, Hanson, you're strong, you're tough. Look at this dude. Look at him. And I would like to add, this man <laughs> has officially worked out with me and can give you all of the, well, we'll just say he can give you numbers. You don't want them. My strength is real. It's not a gimmick. It's not It's not for wrestling. It's not something that's pumped up on paper. This is Keith Lee. This is the real thing, brother. Bottom line, it doesn't matter if or when we cross paths with them. We didn't start this team to go against War Machine, but if it happens, we're damn sure not going to turn away from the fight. You want a war, boys. We'll take you. Oh man, I'd be I'd be really excited to see that match. I think that's going to be a, a great match for for us as fans, and why not great for for everybody involved? It's probably going to be very hard hitting, but uh, you know that, that's all I got for you guys today. Uh, thank you so much for for not not killing me uh, and putting up with my shenanigans. It's, it's, it's not over. No. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Uh, all right. Oh. 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 Oh